going into the video game awards i had one thing on my mind that i absolutely had to see seeing this one game would definitely make my night and it happened what's going on people fam it's Ham here from levelwargamer.com and thank you guys for rocking with me once again if you are new to the channel please hit that subscribe button if you are new and returning please hit that like button share the video it helps us a lot as we are on the road to 1,000 subscribers you guys are absolutely freaking amazing and speaking of amazing, Hellblade 2 again was shown last night and I absolutely lost it. If you guys are rocking with us live last night, you guys know I had to back away from my mic as I clenched my hands together. And I was so excited for every second I saw from the trailer that I do have on screen at the moment. Now, as you guys know, I am a big fan of Hellblade. I played it when it first released on PlayStation 4. I bought it day one, beat it on day two. When it came out to Xbox and it was on Xbox Game Pass, and I believe this was prior to the Microsoft acquisition of Ninja Theory, I played it on Xbox, beat it on Xbox, and to further support the developer, I went out and bought a brand new physical copy. Um, because when I love a franchise and I love a character, I go out and try to support as much as I can. And I've written articles on things I've wanted on Hellblade 2, which the article will be linked down in the description. Please check it out if you want to see my thoughts on what uh, can be improved into the franchise uh, moving forward of the original game. Now, when we first saw this trailer, uh, I knew what it was immediately. And the sounds and, and the atmosphere immediately drew me in because it, it felt oh so familiar and brand new at the same time. I love the fact that you continue to, to hear voices as she continues to deal with it. I, I don't want to necessarily ruin the first Hellblade because for some reason, a lot of people have not completed the first Hellblade game. I'm disappointed, okay? I'm putting cases on all of you who have not finished the first Hellblade. So I'm going to do my best not to spoil the first game. But you can tell she's still dealing with a lot of things. Now, unlike the first game, she has people around uh, around her. She commands an army. They She is, she leads them. They're doing what she's telling them to do. Now, one thing that was very interesting about what we saw is this was not... A, a CGI trailer. This was gameplay, and you could very and you can very well see the transitions between um, things that you couldn't control and things that you could control at the exact same time. Right? I'm sorry, things you couldn't control, things you could control. You can definitely see the difference in between the two. Now, whether this scene, whenever she's actually throwing the spears at this creature, is QTE or not QTE or not, that's you know another discussion. However, it was actual gameplay. I know a lot of people went up to social media, went up to Reddit and said, no, this isn't gameplay. For some reason, people are saying this was downgraded from what we saw two years ago when they announced Hellblade too long to Series X. This definitely was not any type of downgrade. This definitely was gameplay. It was said, it was said by Jeff Keighley uh, during the show. Microsoft confirmed it after the show. I'm sure Digital Foundry at this moment are getting ready to render a video talking about the gameplay and, and everything we saw. But this game looked absolutely beautiful and it stole the show. Like, honestly, maybe it's just me and I have this um, fanboyism for Hellblade. Everything after that was subpar at best. It stole the show. Almost to the point where I wish this was the, hey, we got one more thing. Like this would have been a perfect way to end the show rather than it being the Matrix because of the impact. And a lot of people who are not necessarily in the Xbox ecosystem saw that and say, hey, I love third person cinematic games. This game looks freaking amazing. I need to go get me an Xbox. I need to go build me a PC. Heck, I need to get Game Pass Ultimate so I can play this game on my phone. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Did you freak out like I did? Are you excited for Hellblade 2? And remember, if you didn't play Hellblade 1, I'm putting a case on you. Go play that game. It is on Xbox Game Pass at the moment. And I believe it's on sale on all of the platforms. I'm looking forward to this. Ninja 3 was a great pickup by Microsoft. Hellblade is going to be a great exclusive. Quote, exclusive console and PC. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. This is Fame Entertainment from LV1Gaming.com. You guys have a great one. And I'm out.